my personal name is Matthew McAllister, and I go by the name The Panda Attack. Montreal musician Matthew McAllister has always had a passion for music, and his solo project The Panda Attack was made from humble beginnings. The idea for The Panda Attack started um, probably um, my last semester of CJET, so about three years ago, and uh, I participated in a talent show, and I actually wrote my own song for it. The Panda Attack has gone on to play dozens of shows around Montreal. Venues like Underworld, Café Linko, and Piranha Bar have been home to the Panda Attack shows. But as a solo artist, McAllister finds that the added responsibilities are tougher to deal with. When you're a solo artist, like you have to do all of the like management type stuff yourself. Like you have to book shows yourself, you have to try to promote as much as as you can yourself. Um, if you have to sell tickets for a certain promoter, like you have to do that all yourself. The management side of being a solo artist was a little difficult for McAllister, but the switch from drummer to singer-guitarist was much more natural. I don't know, I don't really, I've never really had a problem with nerves, um, like on stage, whether it be um, drumming or like, or like playing guitar solo. Um, I don't know, I, I just, like, like I, I find if I'm happy with it, with the stuff that I'm going to be playing and with what I'm putting out, um, then other people will most likely be happy with it too. McAllister is extremely happy with the work he's been doing so far. Earlier this year, the Panda Attack released his first ever album titled When There's Nothing Left. The album was also made available on iTunes on November 1st. McAllister is happy to finally finish a solid compilation of songs. I'm, I'm very proud of it. Um, yeah, I mean, it's the first album that I've actually had the chance to put out in any of my bands. With his first album already out, where else does McAllister hope the Panda Attack will take him? Multi-platinum. Um, no. Uh, well, <laughs> I mean, that's the dream, and, and every artist works towards that, and they, they would probably be lying if they said that that they weren't. Did I hear you say that I